Hello, my brothers and sisters in Christ. Vicki here coming to you from Southeast Central Kansas. The washroom, we have some breaking developments here in the United States of America. Um, it's happening right now. It is an active, ongoing, uh, active shooter situation happening in North Philadelphia, uh, Pennsylvania. Uh, six officers have been shot, six police officers have been shot and wounded. Uh, their injuries, uh, none of them uh, are life-threatening is what we are being told, which that in that of itself is a miracle. Amen. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ for that. Um, but the uh, perpetrator at this moment in time, they're just um, has still been ongoing shooting back and forth from the police. They have roped off a residential perimeter. Um, so, um, say a prayer for these people. You know, uh, somebody's lost their minds, lost their cookies, okay? Um, but people need Jesus. That's why Jesus came, to give us new life, to make us a new creation in Christ Jesus. Um, that the old would be passed away, that he would take away our sins. He would forgive us. We have all sinned and all fallen short of the glory of God. But God so loved this world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever shall believe in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. That's the gospel. That's the good news. That Christ Jesus died for our sins exactly as the scriptures proclaim, and God the Father rose him from the grave three days later, and the rapture of the church remains imminent. Imminent. It is going to happen. Uh, it has been 70 years uh, since Israel became a nation. Um, it's God's timing, his perfect plan for, you know, his creation. Okay? All people. We were made in the image of God. Um, the Bible says, the Word of God says, that He knew us before He formed us in our mother's womb. Okay? Um, seek the Lord Jesus Christ. Ask Him to become your Lord and Savior. Believe the Gospel. There's Time is running out because the Lord is about to snatch up His bride, the wise bride. Those of us who have been watching, paying attention, praying for one another, trying to open the eyes of the blind, um, things are not going to get better. Uh, as we're, you know, speaking, there's all kinds of craziness going on. China is about to invade Hong Kong, okay? They are calling the protesters of Hong Kong, they are calling them out of China, they are calling them terrorists. You can't be serious. If Russia came in here on our land, may God forbid it, and said, okay, everybody that doesn't want to be under Russian control are now considered terrorists, I guarantee you, we would be packing our guns and we'd be marching out, okay? We ain't never going to let them take away our weaponry, amen? This is the United States of America, one nation, under God, there's only one God, one mediator between God and man, and found only in the man Christ Jesus, the Lord. Um, Monday in Israel, um, Israeli Defense Forces uh, shot and killed five Hamas terrorists that were crossing over into the border. Okay, things, it's just a, it's a melting pot. Things are going to explode like nobody's business. Okay. Venezuela is about to go to war with Colombia. America is just like all over the place, okay? Uh, we got Russia. Uh, there were five blasts in the last week. Five. Five blasts. Don't know if you heard about it because they're trying to keep it on the down low, okay? Um, these are uh, weapons ammunition depots where they actually store the nuclear stuff, okay? Okay. Uh, it's a, like a mini Chernobyl. Uh, there has been radiation released. Uh, uh, several days ago, I believe it was on Friday, um, 
Russian authorities were telling people to start taking iodine tablets and the people who lived around that that area um, can't remember the name of the Russian town okay that really doesn't even matter at this point, at this point okay um, but uh, they evacuated some 5,000 plus people from this town and now they're trying to play it back and downplay it and say oh there wasn't any radiation released oh everybody's fine you know and also um, Hamas is continually uh, threatening Israel and Iran as well. Uh, it looks like, looks like, potentially, uh, in within the last 24, 30 hours, whatever, that Israel went back into Iraq and bombed three more places. It was either Israel or it was the United States that went into Iraq and bombed three Iranian uh, ammunition uh, ballistic missile type rockets, whatever it is they were holding in these three uh, ammo depot spots. Um, it was not Hezbollah, another group, another another ABC group, okay, the PJM or the whatever they're called, okay, but they are Iranian-backed militiamen, okay? Uh, several were killed, okay? Um, Things are off the top, and I'm saying, Maranatha, even so come, Lord Jesus, come. The Spirit and the Bride say come. Amen. We want to go home. I've had enough of this evil, wicked world. And a heads up for all of those of you who live in the great state of Illinois. Well, it has been brought to my attention in the last couple of days that the state of Illinois will start teaching all school children, yes, all school children, from the tiniest to the largest, okay, uh, pre-K to senior. They are going to start teaching about LGBTQ, uh, lesbian, gay, uh, bi, trans, queer, don't know what I am, non-binary, uh, I'm a spider, I'm a cat, I'm a dog, whatever they've decided they want to be. Um, they are going to start teaching this to your children in the state of Illinois this school year. Okay? Well, let me give you a little backdrop of what the Lord God Almighty um, has done in the past about uh, the Sodomites and the Gamorites. Uh, of Sodom and Gomorrah. Um, he had his angels go in and rescue Lot, his wife, and uh, out of these two towns named Sodom and Gomorrah, here's you some history, okay? And as they were running away from the cities with the angels that God sent down to rescue them, Okay, it rained fire, hell, and brimstone and destroyed both those cities till there was nothing left. No people, no buildings. It was totally annihilated by God the Father, the Father of all creation, Father Yahweh. Okay, you got to believe in Jesus Christ the Lord. He's the only way out of here. Um, things are going to continually to pick up. I love you guys. Um, I thank you for all your prayers. Um, I had an infection starting to go in one of my uh, sutures a few days ago. Um, it's now, it's just about well. I go for my uh, post-op uh, in the morning. Um, still having some pain, but nothing drastic. It's, it, it'll be okay. Okay. Um, just waiting for the trump of Almighty God to sound. Amen. That's right, the dead in Christ shall rise first, and we who remain and alive and are believing, we're leaving, will be caught up in the clouds <laughs> to meet with the Lord Jesus Christ, and forever we shall be with Him. Maranatha, brothers and sisters, I love you guys. Give your life to Christ. Put your faith, hope, and love in the Lord Jesus Christ alone. He died for your sins, and God the Father rose Him from the grave three days later. 
believe it, cherish it, love and adore him while there's still time, because time is short.